I know I keep saying it, but we, it ain't, it's just not, it, that wasn't us out there today, Tone, and uh, like I say, we, we'll, we'll be in training, working on tomorrow, and uh, looking, obviously, to put it right at Gateshead, and we, need, we know we need a reaction from it. Is this the worst you've seen a Mansfield Town side that you've been in since you've been back at Field Mill? Um, yeah, I think it probably is, you know, at the end of the day, like I say, we set a standards high, and you know, we perform well, we perform well this season, as it, as it, on the whole. Um, there have been little blips here and there, but I think as an all we perform well. Um, we, I think what's more frustrating is that, you know, we go to Crawley last week and perform like that and come away with all three points and, you know, we come here today and it, it, it just wasn't us and uh, for some reason it didn't click, And but we need to get back on the training ground and, and find out and find out why. I'm trying to search for a positive. Could it be that Ebbsfleet give you a kick in the pants and uh, that kick in the pants ignites the, the move from now on? Yeah, I think it does. I think, you know, it's, it makes us um, a reality check at the end of the day. Uh, we've um, got a roll of sleeves up now. It's about character and uh, showing what if, you know, that bounce back, that bounce back ability. The, the gaffer's in there. He, 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 owes, uh, he wants a reaction and rightly so. Um, you know, it's... I, I can't. I think we just have to, as a players, we, there's no excuses. We have to take it on the chin and, and move on. Well, move on then on to the Gateshead on on Tuesday night. Now that becomes a, a very very important game. I mean, two games away from home in, in succession. All right, and unfortunately interrupted by the Luton game that could have taken place. But those three points now are very important, at least to get something back from there. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's a massive game. I think every, well, every game is massive in this league, but. Tuesday night is no different. I think you know we're going down to Gateshead. People can say, "Oh, your confidence might be low from today," but what can we do about today? We can't do anything about today. All we can do is is make sure it don't happen again, and we roll our sleeves up and you know get the right reaction of us as a group of players and go down there and per, uh, perform how we know we can do. It's going to be a pretty lonely, I would have thought, quiet coach journey home, is it not? Oh yeah, it will be. It will probably be silent. You know, we're, we're we're and the people say, well, they're not they're not bothered. We are bothered. Believe me, we are bothered. Um, we're all hurting in there. That's that's for sure. Um, I've seen it in there. There's a lot of lads hurting in there, and uh, rightly so. But uh, there's a lot of good characters in there, and a lot of. But we'll stick together, and uh, we'll come through. Um, like I say, we'll fight through together. Small army of loyal fans came down here today. <laughs> what do you say to them? Um, again. But I have to apologise. Uh, you know they, they come down here, they're fantastic week in week out. They pay the, you know they travel here, the money here to get in, and you know they deserve a lot better than that. And uh, like I say, I, I can only apologise on you know on the lads' behalf. And uh, like I say, and hopefully we can uh, repay them and like I say on Tuesday night and get the right result against you. Brian Williams, thank you for giving the the players' side of the arguments, and I would. Having met nearly every player here again and again, I agree 100% that uh, players uh, don't take it lightly, but uh, it shows guts to come out and talk to somebody like me at the end of a game like this. All right, cheers, Tom, no problem. Cheers. So, Ryan Williams there. Well, well, Ryan, certainly not the way you'd want it to be going home tonight. No, definitely not. Um, obviously, we are, we're hurting, uh, we're disappointed, and, uh, you know, it's it's hard to take, but we have to. We have to. We've got another game on Tuesday night now. Is, uh, it's about getting back um, on the training ground tomorrow morning and putting things right and uh, working hard to put things right what was wrong today. Yeah, there's not a lot of time, is there, before that Tuesday and another trip on Tuesday night, another long trip. Uh, what, what, what will you do as players between now and then sure. to rectify what's happened today? Yeah. Well, I think, you know, you said in there, I think, you know, a few lads have said the pieces in there and, uh, you know, it's oh. like you say, we have to look at ourselves sometimes. Um, you know, you can make all the excuses up you want, but there's no excuses today. Um, end of the day, that ain't good enough. We know that, and uh, we have to take on the chin and uh, move on. Seems to be a, an air of sort of shell shocked after that first goal went in. Is that what happened? Um, I think. Well, I think it, it's not okay. ideal, is it, okay. when uh, they take they take the lead so early, and uh, when you think like obviously they've not they've been I don't know how long, 
as eight, seven Sorry, games have not been uh, eight. Yeah, three, they've not scored. Three, so you know, there's that to think about as well. And then all of a sudden, it gives them a little lift. And uh, you know, I thought, you know, I'd give them credit. They, they perform well. They, they probably, I think, what hurts more than anything today, they probably wanted it a little bit more than us. Which that's that's not us. Uh, you know, that's. In that dressing room, there's a lot of honest lads and who work hard for each other. And for some reason today, um, it wasn't it wasn't happening. And uh, we need to we need to put that put that right. I mean, there was obviously a lot of talk before the match about a team like yourselves in the playoff places coming to a team that haven't even won at their home ground this season. Does that, in a way, though, put the wrong sort of pressure on you because you're expected to win and they come out almost sort of desperate to get that victory? Oh, no, I, I say there's no excuses. It, you come, you know, we're, if we're in the playoffs, you know, there's bound to be a little bit of pressure, but it's about, you have to deal with it, uh, you have to deal with it, you know, we're going to go to a lot of teams like that and have to deal with it, and, you know, them who are in the place off with it, they have to deal with it, so, you know, it's part and parcel, so uh, again, we're just, uh, we're really disappointed in there, and uh, we just, we just want to get back and playing and put it right to it, you know, that's right, no problem,